Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. I have a fashion video for you today. We are well and truly into the freezing weather of December, and so I thought it was the perfect time to talk about one of my very favorite fashion pieces, and that is sweater dresses. For me, I find them to be so easy. You just pop them on, choose your shoes and accessories, and off you go. They are very cozy, they're warm, you can dress them up, you can dress them down. They come in all kinds of lengths and lots of different price points, and the stores are full of them right now, so I thought it would be the perfect opportunity to show you how to style sweater dresses. So I'm going to have some casual looks, some work ready looks, and also some dinner looks too. So let's get started. So the first dress I wanted to show you is one I got from Amazon. I have spoken about this dress before. It is an acrylic mix and it's a long uh, dress that is quite a straight column, but it does have two slits on the side. It comes down to about mid calf on me and it also has an attached half belt. So you can either tie it in the front or tie it in the back. It comes in a lot of different colors, readily available on Amazon. And what I love about this dress is that it's really great for casual wear. So if you're just hanging out, maybe you wanna do some shopping or meet with some friends, you can wear it with some chunkier boots I have it styled with my fry boots and um, for the tie you could tie it in a bow if you're really good at that. I'm not great at tying bows. You could do a knot. You can also do a half bow which I have done and then if you want to dress this up just a little bit um, I opted for turning the belt and putting it in the back and so I just have a knot in the back. Uh, put on a little bit more jazzy statement -y jewelry and a nice pair of heels to go with it and now uh, I've taken the look from daytime to dinner and I think it's a perfect option for those of you who maybe have to go to an event right after work, especially this time of year, there's a lot of parties and so forth going on and you just, all you have to do here is change your shoes, switch up the belt and you are ready. By the way, I should mention that it's very important to have the proper foundation garments when you are wearing a sweater dress because they can be a little bit unforgiving. So what I like to do is wear either pantyhose or tights to keep everything smooth. You know, you have a lot of options when it comes to that kind of thing. So just bear that in mind. You wanna make sure that your silhouette is nice and smooth underneath the dress, especially if you were wearing one that is a little bit more form fitting. So my next dress is quite long. This is actually a maxi dress and this one comes from Banana Republic Factory. It is a beautiful navy blue. It has a gorgeous um, collar. It's kind of like a polo collar, I guess. So it's a, a nice wing collar with an open neckline. And this one comes with a belt. So there's a self belt. You can wear the belt or take it off because it is removable. And if you wanted to just go for a straight column, you can do that, or you can opt for another belt. But uh, for the first look, I have it paired with some uh, chunky platform boots. Um, you can do black tights. I like black and navy blue together. They're kind of like a really uh, big favorite of mine. But you can do tights, you can do stockings, and the black boots, I think, just add a little bit of height for this one. This is a very long dress, comes almost down to the ankles and it looks great as is. There's not a whole lot that you need to do with this dress, but if you did want to switch it up, you can put a jacket on like I have. So I picked a moto jacket, switched out the shoes for a pair of um, high stilettos, and you're ready to go for another look. But it's comfortable, and this uh, uh, fabric is an acrylic. So once again, acrylics are really great. They're not itchy. They usually have a lot of uh, stretch and they also retract. So sometimes the older style sweater dresses would stretch out, but I'm finding that more and more of the modern ones have a real great amount of stretch and they go right back into shape as you are wearing them. The third option I have for you is about mid calf. And this one is also from Amazon. And this is a 100% cashmere dress. So. Uh, so many nice features of this dress. It has this beautiful little scalloped um, mock neck collar, which I love. It is in a very pretty, uh, this color is called light khaki on the website, but I find it to be a little bit more like an oyster color. So it definitely has more of a grayish undertone to it. And some of the nice features of this dress include a ribbed waistline, 
so you don't even have to put on a belt if you don't want to. And then it is A-line, and the A-line portion, the bottom portion of the skirt, has a wide ribbing on it. I don't know how well you can see this on camera, but the ribbing is wide, and then it narrows, and it's wide and narrow. So it does come to kind of points on the side, which is a, a unique style feature. It comes in a lot of colors, maybe four colors I think this one comes in and for the price point for 100% cashmere it's not bad at all I think mine was under a hundred dollars which is a great price for cashmere because cashmere is one of those fabrics that wears and wears and wears and it really never wears out I've had cashmere sweaters and I've had them for years but this is a great dress to dress up or dress down. So if you just want to be real casual, you can put it on with a belt and some over the knee boots. Uh, I'm showing it with an OB belt, an old OB belt that I had from White House Black Market. I think it's an adorable look, but you can opt out for a skinny belt if you want to put on some really nice stiletto boots and uh, already the outfit is dressed up. You can do so much with these sweater dresses. I'm only showing you a couple of different options, but if you have a beautiful sparkly jacket and you want to wear uh, this to a Christmas party, but you want to be warm at the Christmas party, uh, you can also opt for doing something like that as well. But this one is a really great versatile option and I've already worn it a couple different ways um, several times already and it's really a favorite of mine. And the last sweater dress is two pieces. This one comes from Banana Republic and it is on sale right now too. So I'm excited about that. It's actually two pieces and it is a rib knit. It is in this beautiful uh, emerald green, which is perfect for Christmas, which is why I got it. And it has spaghetti straps that are adjustable. So the details on this are really, really nice. I like the other dresses, but you can tell that this one definitely has a little bit more thought and styling going into it. So you can see the way the knitting is um, on the front bodice, it also has like darts knitted into the front and then the straps are just spaghetti straps, but they are adjustable as well too, which is a really, really nice feature. So this one hits just below the knee. It is very much a sheath dress and I have opted for two ways to wear this. I think it lends itself perfectly to a real business or corporate look. So I've uh, put on a blazer with it, just a simple black blazer and some simple black pumps from Christian Louboutin. It's polished, it's sophisticated, it's perfect, and it's also very, very comfortable because the dress moves with you. There's nothing that's pulling at you, so it's a real great option. And then it comes with this really cool shrug on top, so it goes over your shoulders. It has a uh, mock neck, and the sleeves are long, but it kind of comes up in the front. I don't know if you're going to be able to see that, uh, but it comes up in the front. So it's just coming up over your bust line and uh, giving a little peekaboo effect. And I think it's absolutely adorable. So weirdly enough, I find that with this dress, the sleeve version with the shrug on top actually looks very much more sexy and evening ready than if you take the shrug off and just put a jacket on top of it. So I have paired it with my uh, Jimmy Choo Bing heels and just some really nice statement jewelry and I think it's actually a gorgeous look. And in fact, I probably am going to be wearing this one for Christmas. So those are four different sweater dresses and a lot of different styling options for you. Play around, have fun with them. Check out my links below to see which ones uh, you like and which ones are available or do some shopping of your own because like I said, they are readily available in every store um, at all kinds of price points. But uh, I would definitely recommend trying these out, especially if you are struggling through winter like we are over here in the Northeast. So that is it for my video today, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please hit the thumbs up button. If you have any comments or questions, leave them down below. Don't forget to subscribe and I will see you in my next video. Take care.